What is up, everybody? My name is Gladiator, and today we are back with another episode of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Last episode, we got our uh, Kyber Crystal and rebuilt our lightsaber. I went ahead and picked a yellow uh, crystal this time. So, what we have up on the mission board today is to head back to Dathomir, our favorite planet. Probably deal with ex-General Malakos. I'm sure he's going to be happy to see us again. I'm pretty sure, if I remember right, at some point there's a boss fight with him. I think it's him anyways. There, any, I know we have to somebody to fight on Dathomir in order for us to get the Astrium. I forget what tomb it's in, but that's where we're headed right now. Before we do that, we are going to talk to our crew members, see if they have anything to say to us. I doubt it. The last uh, episode we left off, apparently there was Star Destroyers inbound. I'm not seeing them. It's look, The skies are looking pretty clear, so they were worried, but I mean, we've been here a hot minute and nothing showed up, so we'll head to Dathomir. After that, I'm, I want to say we head to the Fortress Inquisitorius or whatever that place is called after that. I'm not quite sure, though. If I, I, It's been so long since i've played this i don't know so we'll get all that done i, I I'm, I'm almost positive we only have like one or two more episodes left maybe just this one and one more it, we'll, we'll see how things go if you guys are enjoying this series do consider hitting that thumbs up button and hitting the subscribe button as we will be playing jedi survivor the mo day it comes out but i say we just get right into it all right i doubt they have anything for us later cal please all right yep so just straight to dathomir it is oh maybe man we we gotta go get this planet done i'm tired of having to come here time i faced him yes you're ready to face your past what about you and trilla i don't know if i'll ever be ready you know what you need to do to start healing, and I'm so proud of you for that. I have my own path. I'm here for you if you need me. Fine. We'll be fine. Any bets on what horrible thing will happen this time? More dead things? Giant spiders? Killer plants? All of the above. Don't say that. Or maybe the Haxian brood will come and find us. Are you both still mad at me? The Grease guy? Mad isn't the word I'd use. Hey, you gotta admit, though, I paid you back in thrills. How many slubs get on the Haxian Brood's most wanted list, huh? If you weren't such a good pilot, I'd hand you over myself. Better keep your skills up, Greasy. Damn, that's cold. You don't seem as scared as you were before. That's because for a brief moment, I forgot where we were. But thank you so much for reminding me, Cal. No problem. Well, how are you holding up? Being back here and all. I think I can do this. Hey, if you ask me, Cal, I know you can. Thanks, buddy. I could use some help out there if you want to join me. What? Why would I ever do that? No, 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 I'm not going out there. What do you want, Cal? <laughs> Nothing. Just kidding. Well, I'm glad my fear of a painful death by zombie witches makes you a little bit more at ease. Now hurry up and let's get out of here. Grease is hilarious. Easily the best character in the game. Yes, last time we were here, if I remember correctly, we had to outrun a horde of zombies, and I'm pretty sure that's them, the horde of zombies right up there, and look, there's some down there. Really not opportune. Where am I even? I wish I could just fast travel. I feel like that should be a thing. I should have downloaded a mod that led me fast travel. I know I saw one. I wonder if Ernest gonna be able to run straight there. I think I should have unlocked everything. Uh. Jeez, I'm getting. Things are going well, aren't they? <laughs> what? Cow? They're not going well. We just got messed up by a bunch of bugs. What do you mean? Oh, okay. We're just gonna. <laughs> yeah. Well, he won't be in the sequel. That man got yeeted like 50 feet. We're gonna have to rest though because we got messed up by those bugs. Okay, the good news about this place being overrun by zombies. Yeah, I don't know what that is. I can't see this guy. What was that noise? 
Hmm. Anyways, the good news is the zombies are so much easier to deal with than the Night Brothers are. What's that thing up there? I know you guys saw. Is that a, a bounty hunter robot? Oh, come on, game. Why do you hate me like this? Major mistake. Can we just scan this thing and go, BD? I like the... It, did you guys notice when I pushed this bounty hunter into the wall there, the jetpack broke and flew off? That's a nice little detail. They had nowhere to go. Much like Django Fett had nowhere to go because he didn't know his jetpack was broken. Oh, the frames. We'll meditate and get that little bit of health back. Why not? Do we even... Let's get this. Master. You were wrong to return here unarmed. Not unarmed. You think that lightsaber proves you were Jedi? No. Facing you. Memories that have haunted me since Bracca. I won't run from them anymore. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. <laughs> Damn, you ain't gotta be rude like that. We've grown more power. He just You're ate that like it was nothing. Exhaust yourself all you like. Interesting. Impressive. Is power the answer? Oh, I'm... Okay. Oh, speaking of the devils, of course they're here. Oh, well then you know what? Yeah, well we don't want that. I'm not gonna lie, I always forget the controls. <laughs> this echo real quick. We shouldn't be here. This place is cursed. Don't be scared. Remember, we have a deal. You promised to teach me your magics. Well, that was a mistake. Fallen sisters. This man has promised to grant us our vengeance, but only if I teach him our magic. Forgive me. I must ally with Malikos. Making sure we had everything. Oh, here we go. I knew it. You chose to return. I seen him back there. Brave. But not wise. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm Cal Kestis. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say, Cal. Malikos said many things, too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. 
All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire, I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us and cut down my people, my sisters, until I was left alone with the dead. Then Malikos came and promised me revenge if I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. <laughs> you know, I'm just saying, Malikos I wouldn't mind if ahead. she became our apprentice in the second game. Back. I can't. Lives are at stake. Whose lives? Innocence. Four sensitive children who will be hunted down and murdered. As we were. My friend, I have never been one to shy away from the pursuit of knowledge. Something terrible happened here. A massacre. They killed their own kind. For promises of power. Uh, okay. Or what's up, Malikos? How Kestis? Malikos, welcome home. Need to begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much? The risk of death. I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding. Power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the Order. Restore the Jedi Order? Oh, you poor fool. It's over! Jedi fell long before the Purge. It was stifled by tradition. Deafened by our past glories. He's not wrong. Blinded by endless war. Maybe. But it's never over, Malikos. We stand here now, with the chance to learn. To rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. Dathomir will be your grave. Oh. Let's get it. I was about to do that to him. How embarrassing. I won't let you strike me oh. down. Padawan, I have focus. Dodge it, won't sink. All right, um, things aren't going the way I wanted them to. I was wrong to think you could stand with me. You have no right to stop the mirror. No right to our magic. Get up, Calcastus. You're not dead yet. Oh! 
Jeez. Oh my god. I'm dead. I could not roll out of the way in time. Totally useless. Is a absolutely Let him lie in the dark with his terrible secrets. death until death takes him. Why'd you help me to rid Dothamir of that parasite? What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium, it opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it, too. What Empire? The Empire. The one bent on exterminating four sensitives so no one can stand against it? Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. Thank you for helping me with Malikos. I thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. You're right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah. I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. You should get what you came for. All right, yeah, that uh, fight. We definitely messed up the dodging that first time. The second time I just came in hot swing and I was like, nah, man, we're not losing the second one. This place. Found it. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you and your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. Yeah. After the purge. I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding, I was, I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listen? Well, no. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. 
You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night Sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors, we adapt. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. What do you think, BD? I agree. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. Oh, Grease is not going to be happy about that. <laughs> All right. Well, we got what we came for, finally. We've been looking for this thing since the start of the game. What is that up there? What is going on up there? Look, I just want to get back to the ship. There's no way forward. There is now. Did you race the ones before, too? I did. I wanted to see how you would handle them out. You were testing me? And you passed. Congratulations. Are you gonna help me with this? I'm sure you can handle it. You get hit, hit me on into death. I like it. She's like, you can handle it. I really do hope in the second game... This woman you travel with. She's still um, with our crew. She's here? I haven't seen Wait, her in any of the trailers. I have seen your companions. Marikos wanted me to attack them, but they pose no threat. See her, um... Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I would like to... I'll meet you at your ship. Well, you should probably wait till I get there because uh, Grease is going to have a heart attack. The frames are suffering when you run through here. Alright. So does that mean she de-summoned all her zombies and the Knight Brothers will leave me alone? So the only hostile things on the planet should be like the wildlife. I hope. Nope, she got she left her zombies there. That did not happen, right? Like, that was just a, a glitch in the system there. Prepare for Grease's heart attack. You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. And we trust you. <laughs> Grease's <You> eyes. <laughs> you have to earn it. <laughs> Grab some seat. Oh, I didn't try anything funny. Welcome aboard. They like you. It's probably the most comfortable thing she sat on. It. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> All right, let's talk to everybody. Uh. Or not. Getting stuck on everything. Alright, Grease, I know you got something to say about this. Nothing. I'll be damned. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and... Game. And meditate.
Sometimes the exhaust valve needs a bit of tending to, but otherwise, it hasn't been much of an issue. Gries is quite the expert when it comes to engineering. We haven't had a problem with the Mantis that Gries couldn't fix on the fly. I'm just surprised to see him outside on Dathomir. Well, she was asking about my ship. Of course I'm gonna show her. It's fascinating. You must teach me to be a pilot. Whoa, 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 one thing at a time. First maintenance, then flight lessons, maybe. I haven't committed to anything yet. Oh, look, they've become Cal, best friends you already. Join me? Grease has gone outside for once. Figured I'd take the time to rest. Not a bad idea. You two have spent a lot of time together. I think it's Marin's turn to enjoy his charm. <laughs> think she can handle it? He's superstitious enough to give her space, relatively speaking. Makes me want to learn magic. <laughs> Seriously. I I'm sorry. They are right there. You are talking about them as if they were not just <laughs> right next to us. Grease, you ready for a tour of Dathomir yet? You're kidding, right? He would not last long, I think. Yeah, listen to the Night Sister. Gonna take a hard pass on that one, kid. I may be a gambler, but that's a risk I am not willing to take just yet. Perhaps you can show us your home, Grease. Yeah, not a bad idea. Really? Lateron? All right, I'll think about it. It's been a while since I've been to the old stomping ground. I wouldn't mind it myself. Grease? I really hope that kid pulls through. Grease, are you okay? Oh, Cal, I was just referring to my plant. <laughs> I see how that might have been confusing. You worry over your plants? He even talks to them. Hey, they've been through a lot. Stress may be good for building character, not so good for plants. I'm sure they'll pull through. If they don't make it, do you think you could bring them back? Perhaps. Oh, let me be clear. I don't want any monster plants trying to eat me in my sleep. Oh? Then you better stay on my good side. Little busy here, Cal. I will stay here. I do not need to go any further. Ah, I second that. What was that about? All right. What are you thinking about? How quiet it is. I don't know if it's because Grease is off the ship or something else. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm not sure. I don't know if I like it. Silence is strange when you aren't looking for it. Almost makes me want to fill these walls with music from my Halleck set or something. Yeah, you should start playing again. Maybe. I don't often feel up to it these days. I've always wanted to learn an instrument. Think you could teach me? After this is all settled? I'd like that. Yeah. I could use some time to my own thoughts. All right. All right, we're going to end the episode there. Next week, we'll go ahead and head back to Pagano, get the list of four sensitive children, and I think we'll probably end up either finishing the game next week or the following week. So do join me then. Until then, my name is Gladiator, and remember, the Force will be with you always.